I'm Katrina, and I um, am a very privileged holder of the 2013 Medium and New South Wales Business of the Year in partnership with uh, James Organ, who is, is my business partner. So, ladies and gentlemen, tonight it's really important for me to acknowledge the traditional owners of the land that we are meeting on here in Sydney, the Gadigal Band of the, the Eora people, and I pay my respects to their elders past and present. Also like to acknowledge any Aboriginal or Torres Strait Islander people uh, with us in the room tonight. And also just to say that I believe this is, this was, is and always will be Gadigal Band and I'm very honoured to be uh, Gadigal Land and I'm very honoured to be able to um, work, live and participate in event, events like this here. So over the last year I've had the opportunity to think a lot about what this award means. And some of the things I want to share with you tonight are actually how this award has impacted our business. So very, um, you heard Will mention earlier that our business was around, the fifth quadrant group is around customer experience, design, research and strategy. So what we realised is that business is actually about people being a service to people. And that's what we build the foundations of our business on. Now, the great thing about this award process is that it actually recognised something that we do quite differently to a lot of other businesses. And that is we focus on profit, but also have a really significant purpose. So in our business, we have a strong diversity and inclusion program. We hire people who've been incarcerated, who've been in detention at Villawood. We hire people who are disabled. We have a strong social inclusion and philanthropic program. And I fundamentally believe that this award process uh, was not only recognised that we were a good business, but that we were here to actually change the world. And what we were able to do is recognise that this business over the last 12 months has not, did not, um, the award didn't bring money or revenue or customers running to our doors. And one of the most important things is that I want the finalists to know tonight is that the award won't necessarily make your business instantly successful, but what it will do is bring you something much better than that, and that is this profound sense of confidence. So we're at the moment, at the time of the year of the entrepreneur. So once upon a time for all of us, we were, as, as business people who are self-employed, often looked at as if we couldn't get a corporate job or we weren't able to handle uh, a corporate job. But now, for the first time, really, uh, in the history of business, we're seeing that the old days of the Industrial Revolution are almost over, and now we're seeing the era of the entrepreneur. And it is now our time, and it is even represented by having a minister here tonight who is uh, representing small to medium business. So it's not only the time of the entrepreneur, but it's also the time of the female entrepreneur, the woman entrepreneur. And tonight you've got three keynote speakers, so Lane, myself, and Diana will join us shortly, all of whom are, are women leading businesses. So this notion of confidence is something I wanted to talk with you about because it is actually what all of you as finalists will take away from this award process. And confidence comes from some of the things that actually Lane spoke about. So what happens through the award process is about, you go through sort of a five stage um, progress with regard to the award and then with regard to what we do in normal business life. So the very first thing about achieving confidence is that you need to be vulnerable. So all of you who are finalists in this award have actually opened your kimono, you've opened your businesses, you've been vulnerable, you've been willing to fail, you have been resilient, you have been determined, and then you hopefully have been generous with your praise of other people tonight. So the greatest thing that this Telstra Award process will give you is a reward and not a an award. It is actually the reward of confidence. And you as business people, this confidence will be the thing that changes the way that you do business. So ladies and gentlemen, to all the finalists here and your supporters, 
from James and I, we absolutely are, are honoured to be in your company and we wish you the greatest success in this process. Thanks very much.